Welcome back to Mac with me, Meg. You know, a very strong, independent woman who can handle anything that life brings. Except for getting dressed in the morning because it's really freaking stressful. My bedroom does not have a closet. That's crazy. But I have this here wardrobe and I've spent the last week, okay, two weeks of my life figuring out a ton of organizational ideas, tips, tricks, and hacks that I've put into motion here and I'm sharing with you so that mornings can be much more calm and less stressful. So grab a cup of coffee, close on up, let's organize our lives. First, we declutter. Remove everything from the space. Place groups of clothing in piles. Set aside most used items so you can create a place for them. With chemical-free products, dust and clean your closet. Label piles for wash, dry clean, donate, and to be fixed. To be washed, to be dry cleaned. For my closet hacks, you'll need this stuff. With canvas, cord, scissors, and glue, wrap your cord around the base of your canvas and glue the end to the back. Measure and repeat to create a symmetrical window pane grid. Use a staple gun if you have one to make it even stronger depending on how gargantuan your sunglasses are. Use adhesive hooks to hang on the inside of your closet door and add your glasses and shades. Wrap a pipe cleaner around your wooden hanger on both sides. Glue down the ends, or do a single wrap on each side like this. Voila, non-slip. That spaghetti strap dress won't go anywhere, boo. Make a belt holder with a wooden hanger, S-hooks, and a hot glue gun. Custom cut a piece of cork to fit inside your closet doors. Add washi tape to create a calendar of the week so you can easily plan out your outfits. Print out photos of your favorite ensembles and fashion pieces to make outfit planning a cinch. You can even create a section for fashion inspiration. Use a line of small adhesive hooks to hang necklaces and jewelry that you want to wear this week. Attach large adhesive hooks to the inside of your closet door. Add an S hook or two to hold a whole collection of scarves or accessories. Cover your lint roller with contact paper to keep it clean and non-stick. Hang tools with cord or twine. Keep clips on hand to hang long items like skirts and dresses. Those magazine holders we made a couple of weeks ago are perfect to hold clutches and sandals. Use baskets and bins on your closet floor to hold collections. Place small to medium purses and bags in your extra large bags. For my sanity, I prefer using all one type of hanger. These slim, furry hangers are super compact and non-slip. For shoes, place kitchen cabinet risers on your wardrobe floor to double the shoe storage space. Place a hook somewhere outside your closet in an easy to grab area for your everyday purse and everyday jacket.
Once you've hacked your closet into shape, put everything back. And voila! Sanity ensues. Let freedom ring. Which of these tips and tricks is serving you best, my friend? Let me know in a comment below. And if you dig any of them, give the vid a big ol' thumbs up and subscribe. I would love to see you here next week. Bye!